cat 22 slot 1 quantitative aptitude question number 6 train a and b start traveling at the same time towards each other with constant speeds from stations x and y respectively train a reaches station y in 10 minutes so train a starts from here train b starts from here train a has taken 10 minutes to reach station y so time taken by a to reach station y is 10 minutes while train b takes 9 minutes to reach station x so after meeting train a so obviously if a starts from x and b starts from y let us say they meet somewhere here at z and the time taken by b to travel from z to x this is given as 9 minutes then the total time taken in minutes by train b to travel from station y to station x so we have to find how much time b takes to travel from so basically we have to find time b over the distance x y now this is not even a question of time and distance actually if you understand ratios very well you will solve this question easily without any know-how of time and distance per se because that's not required so you know that the time taken by b over zx is 9 minutes and you know that the time taken by a over xy is 10 minutes obviously both the trains started at the same time from x and y respectively let us say the time taken by both to the meeting point is t so which means essentially a has taken t minutes to travel from x to z and b has also taken t minutes to travel from y to z because both of them started from the same point and on the top we have times taken by b on the bottom we have times taken by a so a traveled from x to z in t minutes b traveled from y to z in t minutes obviously since a takes 10 minutes for x y the time taken by a to travel from z to y would be 10 minus t now for the same distance the ratio of their times must remain the same because their speeds are constant so what do we have 9 upon t this is the ratio of time required by b if the distance is constant for constant distance the ratio of their times must be same so time taken by b upon time taken by a must be same over the same distance xz is the same distance time required by b is 9 time required by a is t zy is also the same distance time required by b is t whereas time required by a is 10 minus t what do you have 90 minus 9 times t is equal to t square you have a simple quadratic equation t square plus 90 minus 90 is equal to 0 so t plus 15 into t minus 6 is equal to 0 so t is equal to 6 minutes what does it mean that the time taken by both to reach the meeting point from their respective start points is 6 minutes so this is 6 minutes so for a this is 6 minutes and this must be 4 minutes again we do the same thing we need to calculate this time t is 6 minutes we have already got 6 minutes now for b the time time taken by b is time taken by b over the distance x to z which is known plus time taken by b over the distance z to y which we have just calculated as 6 minutes the total time will be 15 minutes which is your answer